Hey, what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome back to Grounded. I've got the insect hammer in hand as you can see and there's some grass moving up here. It's a ladybug. I was headed right to the mints this morning to mine those, but maybe we should kill that ladybug first. I gotta work on my blocking. Gotta get that perfect block, you know? I probably should have just crafted a shield, but I'm gonna try and do the perfect block thing. I could use the ladybug parts too, because we gotta repair our ladybug armor soon. Here we go. Surprise, bitch! Oh, got the block. Come on. Let's go, lady. Yes! I'm getting the hang of this shit. Come on, let's go again. Come on. Yes! That one was lucky. <laughs> I'll admit, that one was lucky. She's knocked out. Bam! Beautiful. That was perfect. We got a perfect block every time. Didn't take any damage. That is how it's done. Definitely would have been easier with the shield, though. With the shield, you don't take any damage. You can, you can just hold it up the whole time. However, you do take a hit on stamina. So you gotta be careful not to run out of stamina, or you can screw yourself. Anyway, real quick, while I'm mining these mints, I want to talk about a Freaker campaign that I just launched. This is my second one. I did one... Uh, I think about a year ago. Freaker is a brand. They sell mostly socks, but other products too. Everything is made in the USA. They're a great brand. It's great products. The link to the campaign I'm running is down below. I can put up an image of the products that are available this time around. 250 packs is the minimum we have to hit in order to go to production. It's not the limit though. We can do as many as people want to order. The campaign ends on November 8th, not when the goal is is met and the majority of the profits are going to the St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital. So if you want to support me and the channel and St. Jude and the children, it's all about the children. Again, the link to the campaign is down below and everyone who contributes to this campaign is going to get uh, a mint arrow. Where's the fucking mint mallet? We don't get that from the mint pieces anymore. Well, that sucks. I was hoping for the mint mallet. All right, let me go drop this shit off and then we're headed back to the hedge lab. Anyway, no, everyone is not getting a mint arrow. Anyone who contributes to this campaign will get a handwritten postcard from me along with some free G9 stickers. So if you're interested, again, the link is down below. Last I looked, I think we were at like 37% funded in the first three days, which is uh, absolutely incredible. So huge thank you to everyone who jumped in right away and a huge thank you to everyone who plans on contributing to this campaign. Anyway, we are headed to the hedge lab. Like I said, we got to find that fucking password. Uh, from what I understand, there's actually four passwords we need to find. Four pieces of paper throughout the hedge lab. So we got to do some exploring. I guess I should have hit that spider web that was blocking the door. I should have hit that a few more times because you can break through it. And that's the way we got to go. So let's get to the hedge lab. Maybe uh, we'll mine that candy corn too, if it's still there. Because um, you needed a level 2 hammer to mine that thing. And we got one now. Fuck off, Mike. Let's go. What is this? The fucking Mite hangout over here? It's like all the derelicts hanging out behind the school smoking and shit. That's what they used to do in the 90s anyway. I don't know if they do that anymore. Because kids don't smoke anymore. Now they fucking vape. Which is dumb. We used to smoke because it was cool and, and dangerous. Vaping is neither of those things. It might be dangerous. Who knows? I mean, you are inhaling a shit ton of fucking chemicals that was made in China. It's probably more dangerous than smoking, matter of fact. I guess when they find out that it's more dangerous than smoking, then it'll be badass and cool. But right now, it's not. Unless it's weed. If you're vaping weed, awesome. If it's nicotine, just have a cigarette, you know? Actually, don't smoke anything. Except for weed. Smoke the weed. Look, we got a tooth over here. Don't smoke weed, kids. I don't know what I'm talking about. Don't listen to me. Don't listen to anything I fucking say, because I'm an idiot. Um, yoked girth milk. We're gonna get yoked. We're gonna get stronger from this tooth, I guess. Oh, it's like science. It's like science points. All right. Milk molar. Cool. Um, we gotta see an ASL terminal about milk molars. 
All right, we'll do that later. Oh, um, these mushrooms. You know what? We can chop these mushrooms down. And you get, like, mushroom chunks or something. Let's do that. And we'll scan those in later. You know what else I want to do later? Kill some spiders and a bombardier beetle. We might actually see a bombardier beetle up here, and if we do, we'll kill it. Because I need the bombardier parts for a jerky rack, so we can dry our berry pieces that way. And I need uh, spider fangs for the insect bow, which I want to craft. Alright, I noticed something glowing green over here. I think it's just another one of those skins that you can get. Yeah. Yeah, we'll check that out later. I haven't really messed with them. I don't mind. You know, I think this look is just fine. I don't need to change anything. There is another ladybug over there, but... I'm good on the ladybug parts right now. Um, let's see if we can find that, that bombardier beetle. If not, let's get into the hedges and get this done before nightfall. So it's not so damn dark up there. Oh, candy corn is gone, but the hot dog is back. I guess we'll go chop that thing up. I'm not picky. Let's scan in these mushroom chunks before we get started and see what we get. Mushroom slurry, okay. I need to start making slurries. They all come with a good buff, and I can use all the help I can get. Molar infusion upgrades. Let's see what this is all about. Requires one... We have one, max health, oh, max stamina, hunger, thirst, healing, max active mutations. I'm gonna go max health. I think that's a good place to start. Cool. All right, let's get to the lab. Okay, here we are, and there's a big piece of paper there that says password. <laughs> password is not the password. We have to go find the password that is written on pieces of paper like that one. So we gotta chop our way through here. And I can see a piece of paper right there with an Orb Weaver Jr. So we'll have to kill this fucker first. Come on. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, I learned how to block. Oh, damn it. Oh, it's a little one. That's what was hitting me. Mm, he's knocked out. Fuck off, you little prick. That's what she said. Should I be using the axe on this guy? Probably probably better. It's definitely faster. Alright. Uh, another little one. I think if I get enough perfect blocks, I unlock another mutation. Anyway. Alright. Let's see what we got in here. It's more of this uh, stone, or graphite, and marble, or whatever it is. I think those are used for upgrades, someone said. Not sure how that works, but we'll figure it out at some point. We got a workbench here. It's a nice workbench, much nicer than mine. Um, here's the, the password. Let's grab this. 58. That's just one piece. I believe there are four in total. Uh, let's see, anything else in here? Bandages. Can use those. I know there are, or there can be, bug parts inside those spider sacks. But there's also little spiders, and I don't feel like fighting them right now. There's an Orb Weaver Jr. down there. That berry seems to be in our way. I don't want to get knocked off the zip line. But before I go down that way, let's see. We got another scanner right there. Tape. We can listen to the tape, I guess. That's blocked from the other side. We can knock all this shit out of the way. Oh, another angry robot. We should peep this guy. Uh, oh, E. There we go. Oh, damn. Come on, then. Oh, I should have saw that one coming. Oh, God. His timing was, uh, got me all screwed up. There's another one. Oh, three more. Okay. Fuck. Fuck 
fucking robots. Okay. That could have gone better. Uh, that door is locked from the other side. There's a few ways to go here. I still think we should go down that zip line. Some science. If only chemistry class was this. There's another zip line. Um Let's see what's up here. Let's knock all this shit out of the way in case we end up coming from the other direction. Oh, these this, these webs aren't blocking the door. So that doesn't matter. I'm going down the other zip line, the one with the berry in the way. We're going to knock that berry out of the way first, though, of course. Do that from right here. And let's go see what's down there. And another spider is down there. That's why I'm thinking this is the way to go. Mm. Come on! Damn it! Oh, I'm poisoned! Ah, I'm stuck. Man, I did so good with the ladybug this morning. Now I can't get a perfect block to save my life. That's literally what I'm trying to do. I need a shield. That's what I need. Come on, you fucks. <laughs> All right, he's knocked out for a second. Let's kill it. Yes. All right, now just this little piece of shit wandering around here. Oh, yeah. Oh, barbarian. Mutation. Let's take a look at that. Uh, status. Barbarian. Strong and reckless. Don't need to read anymore. That's me. Let's, uh, take off the Grass Master and do Barbarian. That should help. Guess we're gonna go through... Oh! Another password piece! Okay, that's two down. Two more to go. And I guess we're going through this door there. Let's knock this shit out the way. More spider eggs. And three different ways to go. Remember the good old platformer days when it was like, just go right? What the hell is that? Oh, is that another molar? It's a mega milk molar. What the hell's so mega about it? Does it give us like, two points instead of one? Mega milk molar. See an ASL terminal about mega milk molars. Alright. We will, at some point. There's another angry robot over there. Let's cheese it. There we go. And that is definitely the way to go, because there was another password piece down there, but I just want to check out the area real quick. Uh, alright. I think we were... I think we were there before. No, probably not. What's down here? Oh, some science. Grab this shit. We got another door that just leads outside. Well, we don't want to go that way. All right, let's go grab that other password piece. I Take it easy, kid. Just the fucking zip line. Here we go, password piece number three. One more to go. We drop down. I'm gonna. Out. There's a door. Must be the way to go. Oh. Little spider guy in there. Come here, little shitbag. It's no lemon crime, but it's better than nothing. Another one of these uh skins, ghost mint. That actually sounds pretty cool. Might have to check that one out. Um, there's a zip line over here, but it just leads right back to the beginning, to the first room. And I don't want to go there yet, because we still need to find one more password piece. Let's go up here. Um, up here maybe?
I don't think I've been here yet, so that's a good sign. Oh, look at this, the supply room, holy shit. Damn, our inventory is stacked, so I really can't grab any of this shit. Sap, no. Oh, here's the quartz, quartzite. We already have some of that, so I can grab this shit. And if there's marble, marble, okay. Ooh, silk rope. That takes a long time to make. I'd like to grab some of that. Let's do it. Everything else is nothing special. So, uh, yeah, that's just more clovers. Get out of here, spider. I guess we're going down the zip line. Ooh, there's a hatch right there. All right. We're going to go off the zip line. And drop down right here. Oh, shit. No. Damn it. I, uh... I busted out the dandelion tuft by accident. Um, I think I can get back up there, though. Just go around this way. Oh, that branch. is probably gonna be blocking us. Let's see if I can squeeze around. Shit! Oh no! That sucked. Hey, there's a molar. Let's go get that. And uh, then we gotta start all over. Isn't that fucking fun? I mean, our inventory is... is mighty full. But... I don't feel like heading home. And then coming back in the morning. Screw that shit. This is going to lead us basically to the outside of the hedge, kind of close to where we have to start. And I'm just going to go back to the beginning and run this all over again. I do have a torch on me, so I'll be able to see, and I'll just edit all this shit out uh, so you guys don't have to watch that again, especially in the dark. And uh, I'll get back to where we were, and we'll try dropping into that hatch again and hopefully make the landing this time. All right, this is the supply room, yep, and here is the zip line. Yes, all right, and some science, how do you like that? I'm feeling more Let's get down now. here now. And the last piece of the password, good, because I'm thirsty as shit. Got to get out of here. Got some bandages and some food and a resource surveyor. I haven't really messed with this thing yet, but this is pretty cool. We can up. Get out of here, you little shits. Look at that, two for one. All right. Uh, yeah, this is pretty cool. Any resource that we scan in, we can now use one of these terminals to find out where in the backyard we can find that... Um, resource so these stink bug parts are probably all around in the spider sacks that's why we see them in the hedges because there are no stink bugs in the hedges but let's say we want to find i don't know red ant mandibles that will show us should show us where the ant hill is because that's where all the red ants are and we can do that with like i said any resource that we've already scanned in i guess i guess the mint parts are only in the mint case. All right, anyway, that's something we can always scan in if we're looking for a particular resource. Um, we got to get back to the beginning. Is there an easy way to do that? Do both of these doors lead to the same room? Is this the beginning right here? It is. Sort of. We're close. We're close to the beginning. Um, I think it's down here, right? Yes, that was easy. Power grid, access granted, find the hedge super chip. Um, that door, that door was locked before. And this has got to be the chip. <laughs> Bam! Virgil's gonna be so All right, there's a picture of, of some dude. Probably the asshole that shrunk us down. Fuck Maybe you, guy. Me a or Grab another tape. Listen to some bullshit. And we gotta bring this chip back to Burgle. But before we do that, we gotta stop home.
unload our inventory, maybe get a decent night's sleep, and we'll head towards Burgle in the morning. Here we go, got some food for our journey today. Now, like I was saying at the beginning of this episode, I want to craft an insect bow, which is gonna require two spider fangs, and I also want to craft a jerky rack to dry out our berry leather on, but I need bombardier parts for this, and I only have four in inventory, so we need one more bombardier part. So, in addition to going to see Burgle today and giving him this super chip, I'd like to kill a bombardier beetle, at least one of them, and a couple of spiders. I'm pretty sure we have to take down a wolf spider to assure we get spider fangs. I think you can also get them from orb weavers, but I think we're more likely to get them from a wolf spider. And I think I have an idea on how to cheese these wolf spiders over by the oak tree. I mean, we're headed there anyway. And yeah, I'm gonna cheese them. I don't think I'm ready to fight one of those fucking things yet. Face to face anyway. That's why I made some extra arrows this morning. All right, so my thought for the wolf spider is fight them from the lily pads. I'm pretty sure the spiders won't go into the water. They'll probably stop right here on the rocks, and then uh, we should be able to just shoot them. Well, I mean, maybe they'll jump to the leaves. I doubt it. I think we'll be fine. They definitely can't swim, so that's my plan. Question is, can we shoot them and make it to the lily pads before they fucking murder us? Here's the oak tree lab. Burgle's gonna have to wait, though. Wanna try and take care of these spiders first. Here's one right here. I wonder if we can't just fight it from up here. That's probably not smart. Probably get murdered. I'm gonna go for the lily pads. I think that's our best bet. For cheesing these things, anyway. Oh, God. All right, here we go. It is angry and fast. Oh my god. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Holy shit. Oh my god, just get in the water. Just get in the fucking water. I'm sure this thing won't swim. Oh, where's it at? It's right there. You gonna stay right there? Please tell me you're going to stay right there. Oh, I think it is. There we go. Simple. <laughs> I had to do it. I wanted to get one of these killed. And like I said, I don't think I'm ready to face it head on. If we would have got the mint mallet this morning, then I would have tried my, my hand at the wolf spider. I don't even know if the mint mallet is the best weapon for this thing anymore. Might not be. Oh, well, it's a good thing I made more arrows. There we go. Our first wolf spider is down for the count. We just got uh, another mutation. Check that out later. Get all these damn arrows back. Spider fang and uh, venom. Only one of each, though. So we're going to have to kill another one. Look at what we got here. Another molar. Get this out of the way. In case we gotta run, I don't feel like getting stuck on that. I think we're good to harvest this, though. Still gotta check out, um, what that Mega Molar was all about. There's a, um, there's an ASL terminal in the Oak Tree Lab, so we'll do that after we talk to Burgle. There's some science. And I don't see any spiders, so I'm thinking we're safe to jump down there and get it. There should be an opening to the center of the oak tree, and there'll definitely be another spider there. Our dandelion tuft is about to die. It is dead, I think. Oh, God. What's that? I'm feeling more science already. I don't think it's a wolf spider. Maybe just, uh... Yeah, or Weaver Jr. Okay, no big deal. Oh, yeah, the axe does a pretty decent job on this thing. And it's much faster than the, uh... Oh, perfect block right there. Than the ant club. Oh, and it knocks him out? Look at that. Nice. All right, I want to get this done before it gets any later. 
Hopefully it's just like, hey, Burgle, here's the chip, and then he gives me something else to do and doesn't fucking talk to me for an hour. Where are you at, Burgle? Um, it's around here somewhere. Was he in the first room? Did I miss him? Oh, here he is. What's up, buddy? I found a super chip. You made it back in one piece. Yep. I want to hand it over and we can see what 2000 raw science. That's sweet. Processing. Okay, hurry up. The hedge super chip. The hedge super chip. Which leads me to believe there are other super chips in other labs. Take it from me. Anything new to tell me about? What is it you were wanting to know? Oh yes, the location. Yes, the location of other super chips, please. There are four labs throughout the yard, each with a super chip. The hedge lab, the pond lab, the haze lab, and the black ant lab. You have already made it through the hedge. Yes, he's marked the other locations of the super chips on our map. I mean, obviously the pond lab is in the pond, maybe? Um, all right. That was quick and easy. I'll see you later, Burgle. Let's go here. Uh, milk molars. We've got uh, one mega milk molar. Oh, look at this. Max consumable stack size, max resource stack size, and max arrow stack size. Let's increase our resource stack size. That'll be good. We got two milk molars. I'm doing stamina. And I'm going to hold on to the other one for now. Got a ton of these science points. I guess we should spend some of them. I don't know um, what's the best here. I could really use some good grilling right about now. Reduce fall damage. Mm. Um... I mean, a ladder could certainly come in handy. Let's do that. Zip lines. Fuck yeah. Those will definitely come in handy. Uh, fortified bases. I mean, I do want to craft our second base very soon. That's like on my list of things to do. We might as well make it extra fortified. And I guess I'll just hold on to the rest of my science points for now. Hopefully, those were all good decisions I made right there. All right, let's go kill another spider. Oh, wait, hold on. I got things that we can scan. Let's go do that first. Wolf spider head mount. It's not really a big deal. And the venom is going to give us venom arrows. Okay. Okay. And that's all she wrote. More of this brittle quartzite. We need to figure out how we use that shit to upgrade stuff. Let's go ahead and eat something. And we are thirsty as well. Here we go. Now, we need to find the opening to the oak tree. So we can piss off another wolf spider. Here are more of those mushrooms if we want more mushroom chunks. Not worried about that right now. This might be it right here. Yep. There we go. And this does not look good. Hey, there's another field station. We are way far from the pond. Shit. That's going to be a long run. Let's go discover this field station real quick. There we go. At least it's on the map now. We got another mutation. Natural Explorer. There's some more notes. I'll totally read those later. And I guess that's it for in here. All right. Uh, I think we can get some more flower petals from those purple flowers over there. But again, not worried about that. I, my focus right now is on this wolf spider. It's going to be dangerous. But I'm going to try it. Oh, dear God. They used to get stuck on, 
these clover leaves. Definitely not the case anymore. Holy shit. Ow. Oh, I thought I would be able to block an attack, maybe. Those chocolate bars don't give us much health back. Holy shit. Get in the fucking water. All right, where is it? Damn. Hey, don't walk away. Get back here. Okay, please stay on the rock, though. We got it. We got it. All right, man, that took a while. Oh, fuck. Goddamn mosquitoes. Shit. Get up there. That is one thing I didn't account for. Fucking mosquitoes. I was just going to say, I thought it might be a cool thing to fucking live in this area. The, you know, by the pond, like on the lily pads. And we have to deal with these pricks, though. Fuck off! Oh. This is not the way I want to die. You don't kill a wolf spider and then get killed by a mosquito. I want all those arrows back, though. Okay, let's go. Fuck. Fuck you. Oh, perfect block. I don't know if the club is the best weapon for the mosquitoes. I did scan one in. I just haven't looked at uh, the data points yet on them. Fuck you. Mm, that did a little bit of damage. I don't know why I'm glowing red. Oh, my God. Let's just run. I'm just going to run. That's all. Just run away. All right. Home, sweet home. I did check the gulch on the way back home to see if there would be a bombardier beetle there, but there wasn't. So we can't make the jerky rack, unfortunately. But there is the insect bow, so that's nice. That does way more damage than the uh, normal bow. Let's see. We can make some venom arrows. And we can make some gas arrows, too. Oh, shit. Is this the bomb? Yeah. We need one of these. I need red ant eggs to make that. Maybe that's what we'll do in the next episode. I have the ant armor ready to go. So maybe we'll throw that on and go explore the ant hill. See if we can find some red ant eggs and who knows what else we'll find down there. I do want to move the base and start working on a, a bigger, better, more fortified base. I'm just not sure exactly where I want to build yet. I'm kind of thinking by the pond. Of course, we'll have to deal with mosquitoes, obviously. I was also thinking maybe by the gulch or or by, uh, like, just north of the hedges. I don't know. Let me think about that. But those are the next two things in line. Explore the ant hills, get some red ant eggs. Um, I need to go kill some bombardier beetles so I can make the jerky rack. And then... Of course, we need to start working on our next base. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you're looking forward to the next one. Thank you so much for watching and all of the support. It really does mean a lot. You guys can follow me on Instagram or Twitter if you want. It's at Glock9Gamer. I follow all gamers back. Stick around for more Grounded, and I will catch you guys in the next episode.